All right, so for reading um, all of this arc, we have been looking at um, how sports can create an opportunity for change. Okay, so whenever you are, um, we looked at the focusing question task yesterday that goes along with this focusing question. So we're going to begin planning for that today. So with that, in Google Classroom, you are going to be looking at handout 14A, planning for your focusing question task. So I have linked the focusing question task instructions for you. I have also linked the actual handout that you're going to be planning in today. And then the possible quotations, and I'm going to get to that in a minute. So the focusing question task two, here's the instructions. So we went over the focusing question, which is how can sports create opportunities for change? We've been talking about this for several weeks. And then yesterday, I went over the prompt with you all. So you're going to be planning a speech to give to students at your school who have not learned about the history of the Negro Leagues, explaining why the Negro Leagues and its players should be honored on April 15th, along with Jackie Robinson. You're going to use evidence from We Are the Ship to develop three points to support your thesis statement or your topic statement. You're going to consider the Negro League's accomplishments and the contributions to the sport of baseball and collaborate or, and elaborate on your evidence to support your points. So you need to be sure that you have an opening that introduces the topic and provides background information about the Negro Leagues. We will get to that on a later date when we actually begin writing your speech. But these next three bullet points is when, what you're going to be planning today, okay? So you're going to plan a thesis statement with three logical sequenced points about why the Negro League should be honored on April 15th along with Jackie Robinson, okay? So I want you to think about this why, okay? So think about this why right here, okay? Why should the Negro League be honored on April 15th? All right, that's your whole topic sentence, and you need to provide three points as to why they should be, okay? Two of your examples on those points, and I'm going to show you here in a minute how to fill that out, are going to be paraphrased evidence, so in your own words, and one is going to be direct quotes. Now, obviously, you all don't have the books with you, so we have provided you all possible quotes for this, and you're like, well, Miss Alden, I need paraphrased evidence. I know, but... You can take those quotes and then put them in your own words for that paraphrased part, okay? So here's what the handout looks like. This is what you're actually, actually going to be filling out. You're not really going to be filling out this conclusion today. You're mostly just looking at these top three parts. So this thesis statement, I don't want that word thesis to overwhelm you. Thesis just means your topic statement. This is where you are going to restate and answer this question why the Negro Leagues should be honored on April 15th, along with Jackie Robinson, okay? And then you're going to provide three points to support that, okay? You need to support why you think that. And then you're going to need to find evidence for point one, point two, and point three. Two of them need to be paraphrased information. One needs to be quoted evidence from the book. And you're like, well, Miss Alden, again, I don't have the book. Well, I know. That's why I've provided you possible quotes. So here are possible quotes from the book. And so you're going to need two paraphrase. So you're going to need to put two in your own words and one direct quotes, word for word, with quotation marks around it, um, with page numbers and everything. All right? So that's what you're doing today. All you're working on is planning for your focusing question task. You're only today doing the thesis and those three points with the evidence. You're going to finish filling out handout 14A the next day, which is Thursday for you all, okay? Um, so make sure that you complete this, and then you'll finish filling out tomorrow the conclusion and then any points of evidence that you have not already finished, okay? So that's what you're working on today. If you have any questions, make sure that you let me know.